I, I'm doing this as a voiced video to try and explain this in the simplest way possible. So basically, um, I'm going to assume this works for any NFT because all NFTs have their, their tokens and stuff public. So what you need to do is, you know, find whatever model you want. Yeah, you click more info. It has to have more info so that way you can pull up the token ID. Um, if it doesn't have that, that means the NFT hasn't been purchased yet, which means it hasn't been properly minted, which means the token ID isn't, like, public yet, question mark. I'm not sure how it works, but basically, you need to be able to find this token ID, and you click this button to open the token information in a new tab. Now, this looks like an absolute bunch of nonsense. Don't worry. All you have to do is find this one that says asset. This is what we're taking. This is the model. And it's this IPFS link. Now, IPFS uh, normally is encrypted, and it's its own server thing that you would have to, you know, pay to access, but there's a really easy way to get around that. And it is by going to uh, IPFS.io slash IPFS. So what you do is you take this part of the link right here after it says ipfs colon slash slash you take this entire part of the asset link all the way to the end except the quotation marks you copy it and then you go to your ipfs.io slash ipfs and just paste the link in hit enter and it'll download the model for you that's it uh, VRM models are the standard file format that a lot of VTuber programs use, but you can very easily import them into Unity and Blender and do whatever the hell you want with them. Uh, so yeah, that's it. That's the video. Uh, the thumbs up. Smiley face. Hi.